Buenos dias, gladiadores. Es viernes y yo soy Abby Ragsdale. Y yo soy John Christopherson y esto son las noticias de KWHS. Students, do you have a locker you want to keep for next year? Do you want to change your locker partner for next year? If you do not want a locker, no worries, but if you want changes, now's your chance. Please see your advisory teacher, the counseling center, or Mrs. Price in the main office this week to sign up for a locker and locker partner for next year. We have a limited number of available lockers, so lockers will not be automatically assigned to current students for next year, unless you sign up. Sign up soon and get your locker now. Hey Glads, if you're a senior taking classes at D3 My Way, we have a deadline correction for you. You must complete all work by May 15th. Don't delay or you may not receive your diploma in May. Attention all students, there are no new book checkouts from the library. If you have overdue books, please return them to the library this week to avoid being put on conditions. Return your books before or after school. All books must be returned by next Friday, May 12th. If you want to know about any other outstanding conditions or fees you owe, check Infinite Campus. Seniors, this is especially important for you because you must clear your conditions and fees ASAP to ensure you receive your diploma. Avoid the long line at checkout by paying your fees in the business office now instead of an exam week. Students, it's almost closing time and your books are still only $65. Online sales will stop today. Your books will be distributed on May 12th. That's next Friday. The price will be $70 cash only and only while supplies last. Sharpies will be available for a dollar. Students, we have some very talented artists here at WHS and UMB Bank at 502 Security Boulevard has a showcase of their student artwork. The art show will be up until the bank closes tonight. Stop by after school to check out the awesome work our fellow students created. Hoy es Juan, la señora Betsy estaba en la cocina entre la mañana preparando nuestro almuerzo. ¿Quieres saber qué nos va a servir de comer? Seguro que sí, señora Betsy, ¿qué vamos a comer? Another week down, it's Friday, can't believe it. We're having a chicken sandwich today. Come on down and see me. Don't forget to pay them meal charges. Bye. Gracias, señora Betsy. Please pay your lunch charges in the cafeteria or add money to your accounts. Miss Betsy cannot feed you for free. Students, are you an aspiring writer? Want to get feedback on those great stories you write? Would you like to be published? If so, the Scribe Tribe wants you. Applications are now available from Mrs. Wickberg in room 110 and are due by Friday, May 12th. Students, it's not too late to get help with some academic subjects. The NHS has tutoring sessions during advisory. Stop by the library on Wednesday to sign up for a time and pick up a pass for Thursday. You will be able to use computers at this time too. If you need help, you should really check it out. Auditions for the Coalesce Color Guard team for the 2017-2018 marching band season are coming up. This week, auditions are today. Next week, they go from Monday through Thursday. All auditions will be in the small gym from 4 to 6 p.m. See Mr. Colgrove if you need more information. Y aquí está Dylan Ham con los deportes. Feliz día de Cinco de Mayo. Yo soy Dylan Ham con sus deportes. Open gyms continue this week. Here's the lineup for Bowers Gym. Monday. Ladies basketball from 6 to 8 p.m. Wednesday, ladies volleyball from 3 to 5 p.m. And Thursday, men's basketball from 6 to 8 p.m. Glads, want to see some old timers get their groove on? Alumni from both WHS and Mesa will show their skills at the WSD3 alumni basketball game on May 12th in, in Bowers Gym at 6.30 p.m. Tickets are $6 and all proceeds go to each school's athletic program. It was a great event last year and they, had, and they hope to have as much fun this year. Now here's Doc with some tips for staying active over the summer. Hey guys, it's Doc with your health tip of the week. Wow, it's finally the end of the year. I can't believe summer is almost here. I want you to remember a few things. Take care of yourself. Make sure you're still getting sleep. I know it's summertime and you get to stay up late. We still need eight hours of sleep. Second, make sure that you're being active. 30 minutes of activity a day is gonna keep you feeling well and you're going to like yourself a lot better when we have to come back at the end of summer. Third thing, make sure you're wearing sunblock when you are outside. You wanna protect yourself from those rays. 
fourth and final, make sure that you're eating well, fruits and vegetables every day. And I can't wait to see you guys next year. Thanks, Doc. We appreciate all the health tips you shared with us this year. In tennis news, our ladies tennis team spent the day on the court yesterday at Cheyenne Mountain at regionals and are battling again today in regional play. We haven't gotten all the scores and to know who's advanced to the state, but we will get those to you by Monday. Our ladies soccer team finished out their season with a loss to Canyon City on Tuesday, but we'd like to wish them a great off season as they rebuild their program. In baseball news, the Glads took their bats to Sierra on, on Wednesday night and stymied the Stallions in a 19-3 win. The momentum from the Sierra win and the great weather did not transfer to the game against Mesa as our Glads lost before a record crowd. Next up for our Glads is a game against Mitchell on Saturday at 11. Our track team is celebrating Cinco de Mayo in Pueblo at the Twilight Meet or in Canyon City at the Blossom Meet. They are vying for spots at the state meet and several athletes have great chances of making it to state. Next week, the track team is at the league championships. Buena suerte a todos los equipos entre el fin de semana. Eso son los deportes. Yo soy Dylan Ham. Volvemos con John E. Abbey. Gracias, Dylan. Students, the Whitefield Facilities Department is looking to hire students who are 17 or older for their summer cruise. You must have a valid driver's license. The application is online at WSD3.org, and the deadline to submit an application is May 12th. This is a full-time job. Hey, Glads, want to get some laughs before finals begin? You're in for a treat as the Gladiators actors present May the Farce Be With You, a Star Wars spoof. A Star Wars spoof today and tomorrow. Tickets are $7 for adults and $5 for students. The show starts at 7 p.m. See you in the auditorium. Students, it's that time of year again. If you would like to run for student cabinet, you know, the ones who plan our pep assemblies, dodgeball games, and spirit days, or class council, they plan dances like homecoming and prom, petitions are available now. To run for office, you must have a 3.0 cumulative GPA and have your petition completed and submitted by May 9th. You may run for both cabinet and class council. See Ms. Ship in room 202 during lunch, advisory, or after school to pick up your petition to run. Elections will take place on May 17th and 18th in the small gym. And finally, seniors, here's some additional notices for you to put on your calendar as our year winds down. Senior exams are on Monday, May 15th for periods 5, 6, and 7, and Tuesday, May 16th for periods 1 through 4. Wednesday, May 17th is Senior Awards Night at 6 p.m. in the auditorium. The Senior Breakfast is on Thursday, May 18th at 7.15 at the Cheyenne Mountain Resort. Tickets are $22 and are available in the business office. Friday, May 19th is graduation practice at 11.30. Please be on time. And of course, graduation is Saturday, May 20th at 9 a.m. Seniors, you must be in the small gym by 7.30. Don't be late. Al fin, esos son las noticias que tenemos este viernes. Que pasen un feliz día de Cinco de Mayo. Ya nos vemos. Yo soy Abby Ragsdale. Claro que sí, Abby. Que se pasen un bien fin de semana. Yo soy John Christopherson y estas son las noticias de KWHS.